Hello everyone, this is Bucket of Jam here, and I am here again on the Minopolis server. Um, and once again, it is night. Um, anyway, yeah, where we left off last time, I was um, in a cave being distracted by all sorts of lovely ores, and I said I was going to mine some mossy cobble. So, altogether, this is what I got in the end because I got dis I got um, I tried going back through the uh, mine shaft and basically I got lost so um, yeah but it was it was productively being lost I got four diamonds so I can make another diamond sword now um, you know, I've got enough mossy cobble to last me a while and I can't remember if I had this bow before or not but if not then I made a new bow as well and a few stacks of coal so uh, thorns two enchanted book Obviously, I can't actually remember what I had last time and what I didn't. I also got melon seeds. Um, so we can make a melon farm. And something has just popped up on my start bar, so hang on a second. Alright, I've got rid of it. Um, now it says Java update available. <laughs> anyway, um, what I want to. I hear a zombie. Uh, do I have any dirt in my inventory already? No, okay. Hey, you. You've gone down. Oh god, I hope that wasn't one of my remaining villages. That would have been really bad if it was. Um, anyway, today, episode 5, I think I'm I think I'm think on now. I can't get in. Um, okay, what I'm going to do today is not going to be caving. What I want to do today... Actually, come to think about it, I still need to find trees. I never did do that in the end yesterday. <laughs> Uh, I also need more places to put stuff as well. See, technical term there. Um, well, I don't know what I'm going to do about this then. Uh, but first, I'm going to get some logs and hope that I don't get too distracted by all sorts of epic stuff. Actually, surely I got the Thorns 2 book in the dungeon. I'm sure I did. I can't remember what I got in the dungeon. I'm going to have to watch that back. Oh, come on! <laughs> oh, God. I can't avoid the rain. It, oh, it's always raining. Uh, it just occurred to me how low I am. So, I can't actually go and sleep. I'm going to go and ask this guy if, uh, if, if he's in a convenient place to sleep. Sleep, please? Uh, see what he says. Or see if I turn day, day please. Boo. All right. Um, I guess in the meantime, might as well make some more chests. Uh. Oh God. God, I can't remember how to do this. I know there is a way, but I cannot remember the way. All right, you move, move out of the way. Move out of the way. Move out of the way. Thank you. I shall keep a stack. Put all the tasty stuff in there. All right then. You may not rest now. There are monsters. Screw you. <laughs> Where are the monsters? Go from there, I thought he was right there. Um. Ah, I see a creeper there. This isn't how I envisioned this episode. I wanted to do some. Oop. Ah, okay. Eek! Okay, he blew up. Uh. Yay! I really hope the rain stops. Yay! Okay, brilliant. Um, awesome. So, 
yeah, today we're going to go and cut some trees and see if we can find anything epic like that. I don't know. I don't want to get too much trees because I still want to uh, do some other stuff in this episode. Like, well, like I say, actually, I don't know if I said this, but I want to build a melon farm. I probably did say that, but my mind is in various other places today, so... Uh, <laughs> excuse me if I'm not entirely there mentally. If you know what I mean by that. I'm gonna get you. Oh, screw you, Susan. Um, yay, trees. So anyway, um, when it comes to my village, I have thought of various different plans of what to do with it, and. Um, <clears throat> Excuse me. I think I've uh, finally settled on something that I can do, um, and I might as well tell you guys since you know there's no point in keeping it a secret for too long. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to wall around it, obviously to protect everyone, and then I'm also going to build a castle near it, or yeah, somewhere near it, because there's a castle I built on one of my creative worlds that I think is, I would say, pretty good. Um, so, I was thinking, hmm, maybe I could try and build that in survival. It would take a hell of a lot of resources, but, you know, it could totally be worth it because it would look epic. Um, the only difference being is that on my creative world, it's on a floating island. Uh, of course, I can't do that on this because I don't have a uh, fly mode. Plus I'm lazy. Very lazy. <laughs> so, what I'm going to do is just, um... Yeah, it's sometime in, in, in the next, I don't know, loads of episodes. I'm going to build the castle. Um... And maybe after that, expand on the village and stuff like that. And just have an epic civilization in the middle of uh, wherever we are. Where are we? Somewhere in the plains. In the forest. So, that should be good. And like I say, it'll probably be a long-term project. I don't particularly want to do loads of it in one episode. And I especially don't want to do too many cuts either. I want to kind of show you the whole process of um, building my castle and stuff like that. Just like how I did with the arch racing last series. Um, I kind of showed you all the parts of that. And... I don't know, I think. I think most people enjoyed it. Um, so, if you didn't, then please leave a comment and I will make sure that I do the necessary cuts to this project. Um, but yeah, as far as I'm aware, people enjoyed the archways thing. And if I could do the same with something again, but perhaps not the archways because. I don't know, I think I took too much time over that, honestly. I could have finished that so much quicker had I put my mind to it. Also, I think I started it too soon as well, after I uh, start, started on the server, because I ended up not having enough resources for quite a long time. So, it was quite hard. I can't even remember what I made it out of. It was stone bricks and glass, wasn't it? I like stone bricks and glass. They, they look awesome together. Um... I mean, this castle I'm talking about is mostly stone bricks as well. So, I don't know, maybe I could do some variations on that. Um, I don't know. I'll, I'll probably It'll probably end up being a sort of improvisation project, where it's just like, uh, if it works, it works. If it doesn't, then I'll tear it down and do something else. Uh, after it gets to a point now, I probably won't want to tear it down, because that would just take forever. <laughs> Um, but for the, you know, that's that's my current plans uh, on this world at the moment. Maybe after that, in time, I could do other things like maybe expand the village so it's more like a city, and maybe make uh, an arena of some description uh, to go with the castle. And no, just to give it that sort of uh, feel of kind of like. Um, I don't really know how to describe it. It's sort of like um, a big 
bustling city with all sorts of things going on. Um, I don't know about shops, so maybe I could just set up the uh, <laughs> villagers somewhere and just have them trading all sorts of goods. But of course, it's probably only ever going to be me there, so I can't really. Um, yeah, maybe shops isn't such a good idea. But of course, uh, the castle is the main thing that I want to get done. Um, and maybe, you know, I want to block off the village as well. Maybe add a few extra features to it, like a park would be nice, actually. Um, I don't know, just like I say, it's really just um, in, in my head right now. <laughs> I've, I've got no plans about when or how I'm going to do this. I just want it to happen sometime in the near future. Maybe I could do just a lot of off-camera resource gathering, unlike what I'm doing now, and I'm just getting a load of wood. Um, I don't know which way I came from. <laughs> That's bad. I will assume it was this way, because this way is plains. If it's not this way, then we may be slightly screwed. Please be over this hill. Please. Okay, good. <laughs> I'm, oh god, I'm lagging and I fell. Why am I lagging anyway? There we go, I'm going back at a high. Now it's falling again, and now it's just under 30, and it makes me sad. <laughs> Um. Mm, carrots grew. <laughs> I, I'm not gonna harvest the carrots. Oh, that was a weird glitch. Did you, the food particles were under the water? Even though I was up there. Fix your game, Jeb. <laughs> or whoever works on it nowadays. I think it's Jeb. I hear a lot of mention of Dinner Burn, but. Uh, I know he made the bucket mod, which I think they use on this server, so. To an extent, I could say fixy fixy game dinner bone, but I don't think dinner bone is the guy in charge. Um, <laughs> I'm so indecisive. Um, hmm. I was going to say I should probably do something like this, but then I realised that would take up so much wood it would be ridiculous. So I think what I'm going to do. Actually, no, I want it near my home. Near here. And this needs to go as well, honestly. Because that has annoyed me for too long. <laughs> um, I could do it here. Considering how few melon seeds I've got, I suppose it's no big, no big priority. How many melon seeds do I have? It's only about four, isn't it? Uh... Yeah, four, but I suppose I could sort of make it a pumpkin farm as well. Hmm. Let's see. Might as well make a crafting table while I'm out here. Uh, yeah. Plonk it there. <laughs> I've got no idea where I'm going to put this. Um, men's are, melons are two across. So if I do it. One, two. One, two. One, two. One, two. So we'll do it there. I'm going to have to work this out again. <laughs> um, one, two. One, two. Ooh, I should do water sauce as well. Water. One, two. One, two. And everyone's happy. Um, so what sauce is going to be here? It, yeah, okay, I've got that right. Um, just trying to think how I'm going to do this. <laughs> Sorry for seeming a bit quiet. Um, I should have planned this before, really. I think I might do ten melon plants in that. And then again, how much... Hmm... Alright, so if that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, that'll be too much. So I'll just do the eight. 
Oh, and it's turning night again. Well, at least it won't be raining this time. I've probably just jinxed it now. It's probably going to rain. Probably going to be a thunderstorm, and I'm going to be sad. Because I'm going to be trying to build a melon farm. I probably won't even get this done today because I don't have enough dirt or something ridiculous like that. Um. Hmm. Ag. <laughs> I definitely should have planned this before. Where did I say the water was going to be? It was going to be there, wasn't it? Alright, so... Yeah, basically... Um, actually, you know what? I'm going to do this off camera. Just sort of the... Uh, main bit. Basically I've showed you what sort of shape it's going to be, what I'm going to do. It's it's going to look really out of place to begin with, but I suppose I can always work on that. Um, so I will cut the recording here and I'll be back in a minute for you. Probably in about 20 minutes for me. <laughs> so I'll see you in a few minutes. Bye. Alright then guys, I'm back and I'm, well, done for now I guess. Um, as you can see it doesn't, it, well it's not one of my greatest builds ever but it works and I think for now oh it's already growing. I think for now it'll do. Um, obviously like I say when I'm gonna make a castle it'll probably be somewhere inside there because uh, I would like it to be a, a grand castle. I see you. Oh. <laughs> I if you use this bone meal, it probably won't get me far, I'll, I'll leave it. Um, but yeah, I want it to be a big castle with, well, pretty much everything in it. Um, no, I don't I don't want to have a, a small castle that which I can only just fit in. Isn't that right? No? Why do you always disagree with me? God damn it. Um, but yeah, oh god. I'm glitching behind the chest. Um, yeah, what I intend to do is make a castle which just can fit everything in it. And then it'd be awesome. <laughs> um, but I think, just for the time being, that really does suck. And it's good, it's good. <laughs> oh god. I should probably not have that mentality towards it. It's a great build. No, really, though. Let's be honest. It's 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 not my it's not my best piece of work. Um, <laughs> understatement. So, but I think what I need really is glowstone to stick in the ceiling, because I can light. Well, I don't know. It'd just be better for lighting. So I think what we're gonna do next episode is go to the Nether and try and get some quartz and glowstone. And also, I think we still need to check out the Nether hub anyway. So. Um, Actually, I don't know how long I've been going for in this episode. Um, I'll just check. Hang on a second. Because... Oh, no way. Oh, I can't tell from this. <laughs> um, oh, dear. So, well, I was going to say... Um, I could probably at least make a nether portal now. Get myself a diamond pick. Uh Iron, I don't appear to have any flint. Do I? No. No. Why do I not have flint? Give me flint. Flint? This thing does not want to give... Oh! Yeah, I got it. I got the flint. Alright. Oops. Yay. Okay, so we're going to go down... Come think about it. I don't know where my where any lava is. So this is this is going. <laughs> I said I wasn't going to do any caving today, but I lied. Um, nah, this is. I hear lava, but sounds like it's this way. Because yeah, if I can find lava now, this way. 
Ooh, iron. Hello. Oh, from there, I thought the iron was going to trick me. This way? No, this way. Uh. Oh. Oh, it's not. It's not a lava pool. I'm gonna leave it. Um. So what? Yeah, I'm gonna go down to my Minecraft. I just got a Skype message. So, um. Do I actually remember my way to any caves? I always get lost here. Yeah, I know there's lava dripping from the ceiling before anyone says, but that's probably the same lava as what I just found. So I'm gonna leave that. I can probably see it from over here. Ah, maybe not. Um. Oh God, I don't know where my lava pool is. I don't even have a lava pool. I'm gonna have to find just a random cave. Erg. Erg, erg, erg. Uh, what's over here? Oh, I don't like mine shafts. Maybe it's. Oh, it's not that way. Um. You know what? I don't think I'll even set up the nether portal in this episode anyway, because, like I say, I don't know how long I've been going for. You know, this could have gone on for like half an hour by now, and I just haven't realised. Or. Damn it, I can hear lava everywhere, but it's probably just flowing lava. Aha! I believe this is where I got lost last time. Hello! Alright then. <laughs> and there was me thinking we wouldn't get our portal up. <laughs> um. Actually, there's a point. I don't know if I'm near anyone. Hey, it's a Bartis. Ah, I didn't say hey to the last guy, so... Oh, well, he's saying hey, anyway, in what I would presume is Dutch. Nay? Hey, I can't spell. No, resist the Skypes. <laughs> um... I'm getting so many Skype messages, I want I want to check them, but uh, I can't. Yeah, ha! How much do we have? Three. Damn it! <laughs> oh, I'm sure you guys love me mining obsidian, don't you? Don't you? I'm sure you do. Um. So, as I always get lost in this cave, after I've mined this obsidian, Maybe I'll try and find my way back out, or maybe I'll just call it quits for the day. Because I think I've done a, a good a long episode, honestly. Um, I don't want to drag it on too long because, well, yeah, I try, I, it, you guys are probably losing interest. You probably, you probably all, lo all, all lost interest earlier while I was trying to think of how I was going to plan my um, poorly made melon farm, but. Oh well. <laughs> so, I don't know. Yeah, I'm going to take this back upstairs. How far upstairs though, I don't know. Because I don't want it too close to um, anything really. I don't like having uh, nether portals nearby where I live because that just makes it far too loud. So, alright, torch there. Now we have the fun of finding our way out. Uh, I found my way in. I can surely find my way out. It was this way, I'm sure. Yes, I saw that before. And then it was this way. And it was... Aw, oh, damn it. This way? No, it was this way. And yeah, uh -huh, I can navigate. Uh, this looks f familiar. this way. Yeah, I remember that. Oh my god! Could this be the first time I found my way back out? It was this way. Yeah! <laughs> I found my way out. Oh, I'm so happy. Okay, um, let's see our why. Because like, I don't want it to be too 
far, but I don't want to be to be too near. And I especially don't want my villager to be walking in there. All right, this looks close enough. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Yay! Doop, doop. Doop, doop, doop. Okay, there we go. Now, flint and steel. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to go in the Nether and then end it. Perhaps not there because I don't particularly want to lose my uh, pickaxe. But oh, um, I don't know whose this is, but <laughs> I'm sure if they're watching, they'll probably tell me whose it is. Um, but yeah, uh, for now though, I'm going to leave it as a cliffhanger of sorts. Probably not the most exciting cliffhanger you'll ever see, but it's it's still there. So, um, God, that is loud. See, this is the exact reason why I don't want it near where I live. So, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to call it an episode here. Um, no, I'm not. I'm going to walk away. Actually, whereabouts in the nether am I? Because uh, I was going to say if I'm close to the uh, hub, I could probably end it there. Yeah, it looks like I might be. God, he still needs to put his uh, powered rails there. <laughs> I'm not going to call the episode near the portal. Why would I want to do that? Um, yeah, there we go. I think I can see it. I think. I haven't actually been to the hub yet on this world, so... Uh, God damn it, every time it's near the end of the episode I always get distracted. Right guys, remind me, next next episode, remind me not to get distracted at the end of the episode, because I'm just dragging it on for ages now, and I don't know how long I've been at this for. I don't know how long this tunnel is either, it's, it feels quite long. Glad I ran though and didn't decide to take rails, otherwise I'd be disappointed. <laughs> Uh, I want to know who this is. This isn't going to be a cliffhanger after all, guys. I'm going to show you. If I can find the bloody... Here it is! It is... Seamano2. I'm not sure I know who that is. Oh, it's it's just like a Mindcrack hub. Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Oh God! I just had an awful feeling. I don't. I don't know. That's not going to take me back to my house. Oh God! Ah. Well, guys, looks like. Looks like I don't even have a place. Reserve for Pengix. Marine. Oops, I almost pronounced it wrong. Uh, what does this say? Huh. Ender, ender. Ooh, we have one of those. I didn't know that. And background. I don't have a place. I never have a place. I'm always late to these. Um. <laughs> Well, I don't know what I'm going to do about this then, but I'm... I don't know. I guess I'll have to find somewhere else. Anyway, no, I'm going to go... <sighs> it's always near a portal. Right, I'm going to go over here. I'm going to look at this view, and I will say... I'm going to end the episode here, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and like my Facebook page. Hello. Like my Facebook page, www facebook.com forward slash bucket of vids and I will see you guys next time bye bye